Hi guys, my name is Mr. Specialist and today I'm going to tell you my story and therefore the truth about We Are Amp Clan. But more importantly the truth about Amp Energy as some of the players within Amp are good people and I don't want to affect them in any way. You guys might know Amp Energy as the leader of Amp Clan and a nice guy. But before you dislike this video, hear me out because I think you might reconsider your dislike after hearing me out. Because I myself know a different side of Amp Energy. I know him as a hater, a liar and a hypocrite who is spreading lies and making the community go downhill even more just to compete with others and grow his own YouTube channel. I already told you guys a while ago related to the iFly drama that everyone should just mind their own business, stop hating and watch videos they find entertaining because that is what YouTube is made for. But let's get into the amp situation. When putting up with a lot of hate behind scenes, I got this message by one of my Saxy and Lloyd subscribers where he told me amp was announcing in public that I steal videos which isn't true. But we will get into that later in this video. Posting such a comment, which is a lie in public, is where I reached my breaking point. I still didn't make a video, as I did not want to cause any drama. I tried to contact him on Twitter. What is your problem? I asked him, but no response whatsoever. So I kept it hanging and I moved on. But later, he sent me a message where he all of a sudden tells me I'm pissing him off, which is quite interesting as he is the one talking trash about me behind my back. He's telling me what to do and if I don't do what he says, he will continue with this shit. You can see that in the message on screen right now. He basically confirms that he is spreading hate, lies and talking trash about me behind my back, saying this shit will continue if I don't do what he says. So he basically confirms by saying this shit, he means the hating and such. It will continue if I don't do what he says. Well, little dictator, that's not how YouTube works nowadays. But let me tell you guys where it all started. When Amp was a young channel, they contacted me once if I could upload their gameplay to promote them. As you can see, this was the message they sent me back in the day. After shouting him out in two videos, I asked him why he was taking credit for the player's video and why he did not need to credit the player. Because it's the player's video, I should be shouting him out. And that's where it all started. He started hating and placing hate comments on my video, as he disagreed, which is strange in my opinion, but fair enough. He started posting comments like, all games queer on one of my videos. I replied to his comments saying that he should stop acting like some sort of a YouTube god and a dick and that I would might convert it into a video, which I didn't do until now because the comment is already two months old. Even one of my Saxy and Louis subscribers got my back by saying, dude, I watch your videos. I actually enjoyed them and now you are bitching at one of my favorite commentators. Dude, stop acting like a dick and mind your own business. Which is really, really true. Even my, um, even my comment got thumped up so many times, as well as my uh, subscribers, his comment. But during time, he had been spreading a lot of hate and kept on talking trash about me, talking to people that didn't even know me. As I am a community channel, I asked permission for videos. And then the Sly Secure was already informed by Amp Energy before it stated on his channel that he joined Amp. I reply and get the following message because... I asked for video promotion and he said, lol, you're funny, I know who you are. So I replied to that message asking what was going on. And the first thing he said is he blocked me right after. We had a few more messages and he came around by telling I was cool. I don't blame him for reacting how he did at first, but I blame Amp Energy for spreading those lies and hate about me. And this is just one of the many examples. After spreading hate about me, he was forbidding people to let me upload any of their videos. What clan would limit their members to gain exposure? In my opinion, this is really selfish. I, the leader of AGS and leader of all game specialist, I would never do this to my clan member. As a player within that clan, you will never become bigger than the clan you're in yourself, as you're limited when talking about gaining exposure. 
This message by Rudy Sniping just sets the example that he wasn't allowed to let me upload any gameplay. It's a good thing he respects his clan, but it's a bad thing that the clan doesn't respect him and just wants to limit his exposure so he will stick to the clan, which is a bad thing in my opinion. But now I want to get back to the point where I steal videos. As you can see here, this is the message I got by one of my section Louis subscribers where he says, a member from We Are M Clan says under a video that you steal gameplay only want to show you that. So I hopped over to the video and I read the comments where the Saxe and Louis subscriber told not the first all game specialist uploaded one earlier. And then Mclan replies, yeah, but he steals gameplays, even asking Somulus. I don't see what Somulus has to do with it, but okay. But Energy says I steal videos at a 100 plus non lead to KG gameplay on their channel. This message shows that I in fact did get permission for the video. So where are you talking about Amp Energy? Why are you posting such a lie and showing it to the thousands of people trying to make me look bad? What is your point? What are you trying to do? And what is even more remarkable is that this image shows that I posted the world fastest nuclear, a 206 kill game and a 100 plus with the KSG non lethals. A few days later, Amp is posting the exact same gameplays. My question is, if you might think I steal Amp their gameplays, how can I steal gameplays which I have permission for and that are on my channel first? Indeed you can't. So once more, lies and hate by Amp Energy, the leader of Amp Clan. And what blew my mind even more about Amp Energy telling everyone that I steal videos, which isn't true as you guys just saw, I uploaded a 58 second MK40 mob on the 19th of June. I got over 22,000 views and nearly 500 likes, as you can see on the picture on screen right now. Amp Energy has a community channel called Des267. He uploaded the exact same video months later, and as you can see, he even copied my thumbnail. So dear Amp Energy, so who's the one stealing videos here? No offense, but I find him a hypocrite if, you if we're talking about stealing videos. As you can see in the comment section, I even told him I could flag him for it, for taking my thumbnail, which I made myself, which I haven't done just to not cause any drama. So for the people that haven't figured out already, I will tell you guys how Amp Energy goes to work. As soon as there is a world record, he will do everything he can for the player to join Amp, as he wants to grow at any cost, not even caring about its own members, but only caring about growing and what the people want to see to grow. In this video, he kicked one of his Amp members because the viewers did not like the previous video he posted. Keep in mind, Amp Energy decided to upload that video, as he is the owner of the channel. The viewers find it camping and therefore he kicked the player out of Amp. But Amp Energy decided to upload the video to his channel, not the player himself. In other words, he doesn't care about his members, he only cares about growing his channel and he is kicking one of his members for his own bad decision. I also talked to one of the members from Amp telling how you can join Amp for just getting one world record and that you don't need to get a single good gameplay after that anymore. The player replied to me that the people who got accepted for just one gameplay will get kicked on the January the 1st. In other words, Amp Energy got his exposure for that gameplay and doesn't need the player anymore and he just kicks the player. Once more, he doesn't care about his own clan members, only about growing his channel. What is funny is that he contacted one of my clan members asking him to join AMP. I can understand him trying to recruit one of my members, but how he does it, this is really remarkable. My loyal clan member declined his offer and he got the following message from We Are AMP Clan, also known as AMP Energy, the leader of AMP Clan. Have fun with Mr. Fact Specialist. He has stolen gameplays from AMP and Insomnus. You are too good to be represented by that shit show. You're better. Now ask yourself, would you like to be represented by this kid called Amp Energy, the leader of Amp Clan? I don't think so. So if you were one of those guys that was gonna dislike this video, tell me in the comment section below if you're still gonna do this and tell me why. I have way more facts to show you, but I think this will be enough to prove my point. So my advice to you guys, if you are one of the We Are Amp Clan subscribers, is to unsubscribe, stop supporting a guy like Amp Energy who's toxic to the community and is encouraging hate by spreading lies and also making money of it. 
you guys should subscribe to players of AMP instead as they are cool people. I know a few myself. And if you're one of his clan members, I would recommend you joining a different clan, like for example we. AGS where we do care about our members and where you can get the exposure you deserve the right way. I hope this will clear a lot of hate caused by Amp Energy, the leader of Amp Clan, who in fact is the video stealer, the hater, the liar and the hypocrite himself and that the community can finally regain his strength and have less hate involved. My name is Mr. Specialist and I'll speak to you guys next time.